Hey guys, it's Haps, and in today's video, we are back in this week's weekly, and we're gonna be using one of my favorite pets from the puppy pack, and that is the Panther. Now, for those who don't know, the Panther's ability at level one, perks are two times stronger. At level two, they are three times stronger, and then at level three, they are four times stronger. So in this run, we combine the Panther with Chili, but we not only use one, but we use two Panthers to double and triple that Chili damage, and we combine it with double skunk for the ultimate splash build. Hopefully you guys enjoy this one. If you do, maybe like and subscribe. But with all of that said, let's jump in. It does kind of work if we play this, so we will. And maybe we do something like that. Just with the seahorse and the iguana, we might actually be able to nick another win here. Oh, we don't quite take... Oh, we do take you down. Nice. And the summons just immediately get destroyed. Okay, that was definitely the right move. And we get the level up as well here. So a few big benefits from that. Into puppy. I mean, camel's really nice, but I'm going to bring in the puppy just for the early mitten. And we can roll it. Add you and hold. And maybe do something like this. Now, there's probably a lot of value to keep Iguana at the back just to increase the chance of there being summons on the opposing team. But I think just I don't want to have it too far to the back. And we just charged up their peacock, which is not ideal, but we'd still get it done. Okay, the Iguana was big enough to get it done. I'm going to add you i'm gonna wait to level these um beluga sturgeon at the back would be pretty good but i'm gonna roll and see if we can find and hit some of these Just keep rolling here um i really i was gonna say i really want the duck so i'm gonna do this and we're gonna bring in the duck at the back so we've got the level up here and we've got the level up here next turn Plus, we also have the duck on board, which means that we can sell the duck into whatever we level up and just give it some extra health stats, which would be pretty nice. Okay. We we lose our iguana. It got countered. <laughs> it got countered by the porcupine. That's so sneaky. Well, I mean, that's a little unfortunate. Level... I mean, we want to hold this. I don't know if you can get... And we level you. And I will sell this. So now I think what we'll do is we'll bring in one skunk. And we'll bring in you. Add this here. And then we're going to roll it and look for... I mean, we could go Iguana again. I'm going to go with this. And we might as well do this while we have this on board. And we'll do something like this. Okay. We're going to try and make this skunk as big as possible. Um, and I've got a build in mind um, involving one or two skunks. So maybe we'll try and put that together here. Okay. Takes you down. I don't think we've got enough here. Oh, we do have enough. And the summon. It takes it down. Okay, so we'll add this to you and roll I'm just gonna keep rolling here i don't think there's anything immediate i'm looking for another one of the iguanas um don't think we take you honestly I, yeah i think we just roll here don't need this i think there's gonna be value in finding a banana putting it onto the manatee so that we get the monkey the only thing I'm a little bit concerned about is that there is Scorpion in the game. Okay, you're gone. You're gone. Oh, the summon. The iguanas just come firing in. That takes us to five. Okay, we level into cow and scorpion. I mean, I kind of like cow here. Um, we're gonna We're going to go for... Yeah, I kind of like the cow. Put this onto you. We'll combine these. And I think what we'll do is we'll bring... I, I kind of want to bring in the cow, but we don't want to lose this. So I guess it's going to be big big skunk Bring in the cow. Oh, we're just going to go on the skunk for now. And then... I mean, we'll hold this maybe and roll. 
just hopefully they don't have a scorpion. Hopefully they didn't find a scorpion like we just did. Because if they did, then we're in trouble. Because we've only got one pet, really. Okay, I'm hoping we're big enough here. Okay, some big movements. But we get it done. Okay, that is six. Actually, we're in a pretty good place here. And now more manatee scaling. Um, you know, sure, why not? Let's let's do this. Roll it, skunk. Roll. Yeah, we're just kind of going all. We're kind of going all in on the, on the skunk right now. But I think I think this could work. Just one big unit for now. Actually, they got the skunk, which is going to counter me. We don't quite have enough to take you down. We actually have nothing after that. So, yeah, we're we're a little um we're a little bit light once the once the skunk gets taken down. But let's level you, and we get the grizzly and the piranha. Neither of which I actually want. Um, so. I think now is a time to really kind of change things up a little bit. I'm going to put you to the back, which seems kind of strange. I just don't want to waste the monkey for now. We're going to roll. We can buy and sell the puppy. Roll. We can take the stats from you. Sure. And then, I mean, the crane... We would lose the manatee benefit by putting the crane behind it. But I kind of want to... I think we just roll it here, you know. That is that is what I wanted. That is what we wanted to see. I'm sure we'll take this. Okay, we can really pivot next turn. Um, so yeah, next turn could be pretty interesting. I'm going to be playing something a bit weird. <laughs> In the fact that we're going to play Microbe at the back. No, we're not. We're not going to play Microbe. We're going to play Microbe here. Um, we're just going to put as many stats onto this skunk as we possibly can. And then next turn, we're going to pivot into something a little bit more interesting. Okay, we take you down. And we actually have, I am hoping, enough. No, we don't have enough. Oh, no. That takes us down to two. So now we get rid of you, and I think we get rid of you, and we bring in this with this. Probably put this here. Then we'll bring in you. And I'm tempted. I think I actually think we get rid of microbe. I don't think we play the microbe. I'm going to go without the microbe here. And the plan is to scale up these two panthers, and then to give them chili, and to run... Double skunk, double panther chili. That's the plan. If we can get it online. I was going to try and incorporate the microbe into this build somehow, but I don't think it's going to be doable. Um, so we're going to add this to... We can add this to you. Then we can add the chili to you. And maybe put you out first now. Then you second. Um... Hmm, yeah, sure, we'll do this and roll. Okay, that's pretty that's pretty good. In fact, that's very good. We get the extra chili on you, so we're gonna we're gonna hit with this skunk and this skunk. We're hit with this skunk first. You're gonna actually get a decent amount of damage away onto that rhino. Oh, you actually take the rhino down. Okay, pretty nice. Now we're gonna roll. And we're going to look for, basically, we're going to, I mean, actually, Armadillo here giving more health is pretty nice as well. Because the more health is better. Because it means you can do more hits with your chili. And you're just going to do even more damage with the chili. But you know what? I'm, I'm just going to leave it as it is. We're just going to roll. In fact, we could do this for the health. And we can just roll it. Um, I mean, Tiger for another skunk, I guess. I mean, sure. Like, actually, in a pretty nice situation here. Would like another chili. 
I would like to go extra chilly onto here. But we should be doing... We could do some pretty serious damage now. Oh, that's big. And we're down... We're, we've still got two, two HP, but we're down to needing one more trophy. We're going to get rid of you. Bring this in here. Um, I'm going to hold this. I actually kind of want to look for a chili. So we're just going to roll and see if we can find chili here. If we can't find it, then we're definitely going to be throwing. Um, but if we do find it, which we don't. So we'll bring the tiger in. If we lose this one, we lose this one. I kind of want to get double chili. Um, but anyway, we're going to be striking quite a few things with these skunks. Do we have enough? It's going to be close. Okay, we're down to one. A draw there would have been extra nice, but now we get an opportunity to find the chili. So we're just going to roll for it. We get it. Okay, chili goes in here. And then, I mean, we don't have enough of the panther, but we could find another skunk. So I'm going to roll this and look for another skunk or tiger. We get the skunk. And we run it like this. You know what? We've got to run it something like... Oh, we'll run it like this. And maybe... <laughs> yeah, we'll run it like this. I was, I was trying to think of a better way to order it, but... Triple skunk into... Oh, but then they got the chili as well. I mean, we're big enough to take it down and we get it done. But double chili skunk. It would have been nice to have maybe got a little extra health onto these panthers. But I really like this build. I was going to try and bring the microbe in somehow, but the problem is that just removes the chili. Um, it would have been good to have had maybe tar in the pack and then we could have reapplied the chili. But this is a fun build. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, maybe like and subscribe. But thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.